Hello, everybody. This is Pastor Phil with Full of Life Ministries. Today's message is entitled, Take a Breath. Psalms 119 verse 73 tells us, with your very own hands, you formed me. Now breathe your wisdom over me so I can understand you. There's a lyric in the song that says, sometimes you're in the desert. Sometimes you feel the pain. Sometimes he calms the storm and sometimes he lets it rain. Please don't hold your breath, just breathe. Listen, everybody, anxiousness, worry, negative thoughts, unbelief, and all of the various emotions that try to sabotage your outlook for your present and future goals are related to and connected to this mechanism that the good Lord has instilled in every person. And it's the ability to breathe. The importance of breathing is to send oxygen into the cells of our body, which constantly needs a new supply of air so our bodies can produce energy. And this is a natural function we all know. But right now, I want us to understand the spiritual aspect of breathing in God's wisdom into our daily life's challenges. Because if we hold our breath for an extensive amount of time because of the pressures that life throws our way, it can cause you to lose strength and have you miss out on moving forward towards your destiny. Proverbs, the fourth chapter, verses six and seven says, do not forsake wisdom and she will protect you. Love her and she will watch over you because wisdom is supreme. Therefore, get wisdom. Though it costs all you have, get understanding. If you really want his wisdom, take a breath and then go after it. This takes resolve. It takes a determination not to abandon the search once you begin, no matter how difficult the road may become you will experience the fullness of life once you make up in your mind that this is the only path to understand your purpose for being here on this planet. Today or tonight, my prayer is for you is to receive God's wisdom and breathe in a refreshing breeze that will enable you to excel in whatever you were born to do. People of God, please try this with me. Inhale, exhale. Now, think of the possibilities of what the Lord is going to do for you. For it is He who changes the atmosphere once we open our hearts to Him. I want you to be encouraged today, and I want you to continue to keep shining. And thank you once again for tuning in to Full of Life Ministries. God bless you.